We're going to talk a little baseball today. I know it may be football season, but baseball is a year-round sport now. Carl Martin Noose joins us now. He's with the Arkansas Baseball Academy. I know you guys got a big showcase coming up. Tell us a little bit about the showcase, what will be going on. Sure. Um, October 11th is Sunday. Uh, I, my friend, I guess a friend of ours, Pete Laven, who's the uh, general manager for the Travs, he's gracious to, enough to let us go out there October 11th from 1 to 5. We're going to go out there and let the kids kind of showcase their talents as far as, you know, running the 60s, you know, throwing the uh, ball across the diamond, fielding some ground balls, throwing some bullpens, hitting the ball live on the field. To me, that's a, you know, it's a treat for the kids to be out there on Dickey Stevens Field anyway. That's a nice place. It's pretty cool. Yeah. You know, college scouts are going to be there. It's a chance to shine in front sure. of some uh, important eyes. Sure. We've got, we've had at least 12, I'll say 12 to 15 verbally committed to come. Um, you know, we'll have the coaches from ULR, UCA, um, all the way down to, you know, Lyon College, OBU, Arkansas Tech, Harding, Arkansas Monticello. So we're excited. We've had a couple from out of state, Coffeyville Junior College and Bowdoin Parish said they were going to come. So we're excited about those. Is this open to any high school kid that wants to showcase his skills? It is. We've uh, got a you know, website to say, hey, we're, email us, we'll register you. Now, we're trying to get pre-registration to, up to October 4th because we're going to have a T-shirt for these kids. I've learned a little something today about, well, the Arkansas Baseball Academy and baseball in general. It, it's a year-round sport these days. It's not just your spring ball or summer ball. You guys are going, it seems like, all year. It is. I mean, it, that's what every sport is now. Yeah. It's all year round. And, you know, you just got to, you know, you got to think of that mentality that somebody's out there and they're working that much harder than you. So that's got to be the pushing motivation for you to go out there and work just as hard as they are. I mean, in the off season, they're doing their strength and training and their strength and conditioning, the speed training, whatever it is to get that slight competitive edge over someone else. Does the interest of baseball kind of follow the Hogs? When they go to Omaha, do well, you get more kids wanting to play baseball? Each year, each year I've gotten more phone calls. and It's gotten to the point where I'm like, wow, we, we play in the fall and we go to these college campuses and, like sometimes we have to turn some kids away and say, well, just, we'll get with you next year. And we hate that. And, you know, my coaching staff and myself, we would just, we almost want to have another team just to keep, you know, not turning anybody around because we love the kids. We want the kids to do well. We try to help them succeed. And if we can find some way of getting them a place, because we feel like there's always a, pl- a college, even if it's like Williams Baptist or Lyme or Arkansas Tech whatever, some level, UALR, whatever whatever level it is, that we think some kids can play, you know, either up at North Ark and Harrison. Carl, we appreciate your time. We'll link all this information on our website, so if anyone's interested in going to the uh, fall showcase, they can check your website out. Thanks Great. for joining Thank us. Thank you.